Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another episode of Mass Effect Legendary Edition. We are just going to be kicking straight off into this I think and doing the DLC. I think it's the DLC. Uh, Dr. Bryson's apartment. Dr. Bryson something. Citadel, Dr. Bryson. Working on a classified project and needs help. Contact him at his lab, not his apartment. Uh, yeah, so I believe we're kind of coming into the home stretch. Which I'm not I'm not happy about putting this down. I want to keep going. <laughs> um so Dr. Bryson's lab. I can't remember what he said to do or why he, I'm going there, but telling me to spend powers. Spend points. There you go. I want you to match this against all known locations and update the map. Then contact the field teams for a progress report. Yes, sir. I'm Commander Shepard. We've been expecting you. Just a moment. And Hadley, could you gather the Leviathan data for us? Apologies, Commander. The rest of my team is out investigating leads right now. I'm Dr. Garrett Bryson, and this is Task Force Aurora. Task Force? What's your assignment? Our mandate is to investigate legends, rumors, old stories about the Reapers before anyone knew they existed. <laughs> like League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. <laughs> Be all the, the legends and fantasy characters. Um, I was so sorry, they're just scanning biblical texts and stories and rumors to try and see if there might be something in them that's a little far-fetched. That's an interesting goal, but is anyone doubting the Reapers exist these days? The Alliance is still desperate for intelligence. Reaper motives, their operational tactics. Anything that can give us an edge. And how did you wind up in charge? When the rest of the galaxy says something doesn't exist, I take that as a chance to prove that it does. So you're in it for the challenge? For the truth. Even as late as 2148, Humanity still thought aliens were a myth. That was within my lifetime. Once that myth was proven to be reality, our entire history changed. Reapers were part of that reality too. But even they have a history, Commander. If we can just uncover it, there may be a weakness we can exploit. Okay, I mean, yeah, there is something. Every little helps, so to speak. Uh, it does sound quite useful. Could have used your help three years ago. <laughs> yeah. Yes. If people had paid more attention to your Prothean beacon, we might not be in this war. But now with new information we've uncovered, a breakthrough's near. Hadley, do you have the data? No! Oh, hey, hey, ho, ho! Stop him! Stop him! <laughs> Throw a data pad. This is Commander Shepard. I need C-Sec at my location, now! You shouldn't be here. The darkness can't be breached. The darkness? Transit records show his name is Derek Hadley. He's worked here for a couple months. Shepard, I monitored a CSEC alert from this location. Were you harmed? I'm fine. But I could use your help sorting this out, Edie. Take a look through their files. I need to know what this task force was up to. At once. What? I... What's happening? <laughs> So you're a murderer. So, no, what I wanted to say was the darkness. There's been something that's gone through all of this, and it keeps popping up in my head, and I keep trying to lay it in. I've, I've not said much on it, because I fear that I've missed something, and I'll look stupid. But there was a whole bunch of stuff about dark energy. Dark energy was making a sun age faster, and basically destroy that system. Um, there's a couple of other mentions as well, but the Reapers, they stay out in dark space, don't they? So is that a Reaper talking to him from dark space? The darkness cannot be breached. Have we got coordinates to the dark space? Got a secondary map. Anyway, this guy, uh, you're a murderer. You just shot your boss. He's dead. Why? After you arrived, it was dark, cold. Like I was somewhere else. That was... Take a good look. You did that. <laughs> you pulled the trigger and killed him. 
No. No. I couldn't have. He did. No! I'm not a murderer! You're lying! Okay, no, come on. Explain it. What happened here? So someone else pulled that trigger? But I would never do that! Commander, this does resemble reports of indoctrination. Yeah. Indoctrination? Yeah. Me? What about that Leviathan Bryson mentioned? How does that tie in? It's some kind of creature. Our field teams have been tracking it. That artifact came in from our researcher, Garneau. He sent an audio log if you want to... What's wrong? Turn back. What are you talking about? The darkness cannot be breached. Oh, Damn for it. God's sake. Get him over to the clinic. See if they can tell us what's wrong with him. Scientists, stop yes, dying. Commander, you'll want to see this. It's an outgoing message from Dr. Bryson to Admiral Hackett. Dr. Bryson, you have an update? Admiral, the Leviathan of Dis that we've been investigating, I think we're really onto something. Give me the brief. About 20 years ago, the Batarians discovered a Reaper corpse that had died in battle. They covered it up and denied it ever existed. But I'm intrigued by the larger implication. What could have killed the Reaper in the first place? Exactly. That's the real Leviathan. It's worth pursuing. Continue your investigation and update me on the progress. There is also a follow-up message from a few weeks later. Admiral, the Reapers are shadowing my field teams as if they're hunting Leviathan themselves. Whatever it is, I believe Leviathan is nothing less than a Reaper killer. Almost an apex predator, and it has them nervous. Orion? If we could just find it, imagine the impact on the war. I'm formally requesting assistance in tracking it down. You'll have it. This is now your top priority, Doctor. Find that thing. It appears we were meant to be that assistance. Oh, shouldn't have left it this late then. Um, so Leviathan means massive thing, doesn't it? Using my magic the gathering knowledge. Anything, anytime it's Leviathan, it's a big blue creature. But what's to say that the thing that killed the Reaper was one thing? What if it was, like, I don't know, the entire Prothean army, the Armada, shooting the crap out of it? Killed it, just like we've killed other Reapers. Why do they think it's just one big thing? Could be useful. I see Bryson's point. Anything capable of bringing a Reaper down is worth finding. Yep. Despite the potential dangers it could pose, I would agree. But we won't know unless we can find it. Bryson's assistant did say they recently received a log from their field researcher. It may yield more information. Find audio log directly in front of me. Audio log. Let's have a little look around. Is that a Prothean beacon? A hunk of metal? Wait, that's a Krogan's head. Hang on, there was a statue of a Krogan on the citadel. Is that the head of it? <laughs> we'll just keep it. Why the fuck not? Okay, that's interesting. <laughs> I love it. It serves no purpose whatsoever. I need it. There's smoke coming from it. Well, you know, it's ten to five on a Friday. You just want to, you want to do something else before you go home. Why not make one of them? Uh, I guess it is this audio log. This must be the artifact the assistant mentioned. And here's the log. Doctor Bryson, it's Garneau. I'm sending you an artifact I found. About the only thing I found there, in fact. Maybe it's nothing, but I'd swear Leviathan came through here. I'm gonna crunch some numbers, burn up the rest of this project travel allowance. Maybe I can project our Reaper killer's movements. I'll check in when I get to the next site. Garno okay. appears to be our best lead to track Leviathan, but he does not stay to destination. We can find him together. No, you're an AI and a computer. You can just work it out. Get me one. He's out there somewhere, and we need him. 
I'll do what I can. Bryson and his colleagues evidently used a galaxy map search program in their hunt for Leviathan. It may help us locate Garneau. Okay. So this thing is the is the artifact in question. So does that mean that because it kind of looks like the orb that I had in my in my in my room in Mass Effect 2, which I'm kind of understanding why they took off me. Do I get that one? Do I get the Krogan head? I kind of want the Krogan head. I imagine that's what a, a plushie is to a Krogan. I will always do that when I walk past. Um, am I supposed to do anything? Is it the, uh, oh, the galaxy map. That'll do. Does this tell us where Garnon went? No. But we may be able to narrow down his location if we find clues he was using in his search for Leviathan. Search lab for clues. Prothean artifact. Is this Prothean? Yes. I believe Dr. Bryson and Liara would have had much to discuss. Can you add a search filter for locations known to have Prothean ruins or artifacts? Adding the search filter, you may examine the results on the galaxy map program. Okay. Um, I imagine Javik would probably have a little bit more. I didn't get to bring anyone. Makes me happy. Uh, oh, hello. Computer console. These are all murders in which the accused lacked a known motive and claimed memory loss. Just like Bryson's assistant. You think Garneau was following a trail of blackout crimes? It is possible. We need to find data matching dates and locations for crimes of this nature. Just having a little look on the, each one of these pictures. Some of them are on the middle, middle row towards the left. They look like real photographs, like black and white photographs. I wonder if there's a, e a couple of Easter eggs in there or something. Uh, computer console. Here's the time and date chart for the crimes. Can you filter for murders where the killer claimed memory loss? Adding this search filter to the galaxy map. That seems like a fair assumption. Oh, wow, this place is huge. <laughs> <gasps> Nessie! Loch Ness Monster! Or is that a Cacliosaur? Loch Ness Monster? Loch Ness Monster! Plesiosaur. Loch Ness Monster is more interesting. Exactly! Interesting and non existent. Edie, we're gonna fall out in a minute. Not non existent. Nessie lives! Just haven't found her yet. Uh, video lock. Sir, this is Bryson. We know the Reapers what? are after Leviathan. Studying Reaper hunting patterns could be vital to finding it. That data is classified top secret, Dr. Bryson. If it falls into the wrong hands... It won't. The data's encrypted. I'll keep the decryption key safe. Close to my heart. Close to his heart? What the hell does that mean? Where's his body? He's got it tattooed on his heart or something. The Reaper fleet activity is encrypted. Per Bryson's statement in the log. He said he was keeping the decryption key close to his heart. What does he love? Chocolate? Sovereign... A sovereign fragment. That's a bit of a reaper. Sovereign. Vanguard of our destruction. How's that working out for you, big guy? <laughs> I mean, I'm a little bit more worried about the fact that it's just there. We can go outside. High velocity barrel, I'll take that. I have no problem looting the dead. Rapid trans. Oh, that's uh, that's going to be for leaving, I guess. I so I can actually go back to the story at any point. Interesting. Ultralight materials. Okay, back to the grind. Um, oh, what the hell is huge? Okay, that was Nessie. Bryson was Whoa. tracking unexplained creature sightings. Bryson was not merely tracking sightings. 
He was attempting to extrapolate a course. Then Garneau could have been following that course. Edie, can you add a search filter for systems along that projected path? Adding the search filter now. That seems likely. That mixed with the blackout crimes. Seeming pretty decent at the moment. Meteorite fragment, maybe? He was studying it as an object of importance. We should look more closely at a sample. Meteorite sample. With traces of element zero. Would Leviathan need Ezo? While it is not consumed as fuel during FTL travel, element zero will decay after several centuries of active use. If Leviathan is old enough, it would need to replenish its supplies. Okay. Can you give me a search filter for locations with element zero? Adding it now. Okay. Element zero is a naturally occurring thing, right? It just so happens to be um, prevalent on Thessia. So does that mean that... It's difficult. How involved are the Reapers in the next cycle? Do they plant seeds? Do they put people in various different places? Because surely the amount of Ezo on Thessia... Let, let's say the Reapers win this cycle, which I, I've got a feeling they might. Um, they kill everyone. And then the next cycle comes round, but Thessia is laid to waste. But only on the surface, because they keep the planets alive. They don't destroy the actual planet itself. So the next cycle come round, nobody's on Thessia. So let's say the Yarg, they sort of, they, they come up, they're the leaders of the next cycle. They come in and go, oh, planet, let's go over there, Thessia. And aren't they gonna, just going to all die War of the World style from just Ezo exposure because <laughs> didn't humans get uh, accidentally poisoned with Ezo and they died didn't they 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 like the they got tumors and like it's not pretty Caden kind of painted an ugly picture for it Thorian I fucking called it the Thorian a life form discovered on Pharos provides fascinating insight into the life cycle of a truly alien species Unlike conventionally intelligent life, it does not use mass relays. Prothean artifacts would not interest it. Commander Shepard claims that Reaper's en Reaper enemies cultivated life to evolve along lines they could predict, using technology the Reapers controlled. The Thorian is an exception to that rule. It, invo it evolved to use organic tools rather than conventional technology. Leviathan must be somehow similar to have survived undetected for so long. The Thorian used pain conditioning to control its victims, using them as manual labour, or even as a man would use his own hands and fingers. Commander Shepard claims that the Reapers do the same thing through a different process called indoctrination. Whatever Leviathan is, it must do something similar. Yeah, I mean, if depending on how big it is, like if it is, what, Reaper-sized, or at least Reaper-adjacent, it's got to have lackeys. It can't do everything itself. Unless they've built an entire city to Reaper scale, which would be hilarious. All right. Looks like data on the Rachni. Well, that is how they were talking. Uh, that, that guy was talking as though a Rachni was sort of taking its brain. March 7th, 2186. I'm looking at the Rachni. Their movements during the Rachni Wars suggest alien influence. But the timing is wrong, and Rachni weren't implanted with Reaper tech. What if Leviathan was preparing the Rachni to fight the Reapers? What do you think, Edie? It is possible that Bryson's team is using ancient Rachni fleet activity to find Leviathan. We saw a data pad containing data on Rachni movements earlier. It may be relevant. The Rachni data. Oh, there. Okay. You had a cross reference for locations <laughs> of sightings. Doing so now. I feel like Edie is like a teacher leading me on, like, no, you can find the answer. I believe we found a data pad somewhere, and it's like right in front of you. It's that one. A oh, good boy, Shepherd. 
uh, drawing. By Anne Bryson. Age nine. The kid's drawing. Records indicate Anne is now 28. She works for the Alliance. Bryson was keeping the encryption key close to his heart. What's closer than family? An interesting hypothesis. But I detect no trace of the decryption key in this... Art. <laughs> art. By Anne Bryson. Oh. Age nine. Records indicate Anne is now hand 28. On. She works for the Alliance. Yeah, big stupid Bryson jellyfish. Bryson is keeping the encryption key close to his heart. Right. What's closer than family? An interesting hypothesis. But I detect no trace of the decryption key in this... Art. Oh, Reaper. Ancient Reaper texts. <laughs> Who doesn't have a library next to the toilet, eh? Towels. Towels everywhere. A lone data pad and a coffee. I wouldn't want to bring my coffee in there. Alright. Rather than judging a dead man's toilet, let's go upstairs. There's another kid's drawing. Another piece of Anne Bryson's childhood art. Wait a minute. Stop stressing the art. Well, take a look at that. I can use these numbers to construct a decryption key. All right. Let's get back to the data pad we found earlier. I wouldn't exactly say that's hidden. That's just scrawled upon child's art. Like, no one's going to look at that and go, Oh, yes, Anne Bryson. Look, there's Daddy, there's the Sun, there's the ground, and there's 65.AB723. Of course it's going to be a key to something. Dr. Bryson, per your request, I'm clearing Task Force Aurora for intercepted Batarian communications regarding the Leviathan of Dis. Commander, the Dreadnought is in custody, but the Solarians may have surveillance footage. Our ambassador will issue a full denial. Give me your preliminary analysis. Several million years old, at least. And its technology outstrips anything on the Council. Excellent. Our scientists will work day and night to bring its secrets to the hegemony. One concern, Commander. The real Leviathan of Dis, the thing that destroyed the ship, is still out there. Unaccounted for. Irrelevant. The ship is our priority. And as far as the rest of the galaxy is concerned, there is no Leviathan of Dis. There never was. Okay. That's interesting. Ooh. Nice little picture there. Um, I'm intrigued to find out why the Batarians weren't... It, it would have been good if between Mass Effect 1 and 2... We didn't really see many uh, Batarians in Mass Effect 1. If we saw a few more Batarians in Mass Effect 1, then between 1 and 2... Uh, there was just this massive jump in their technology, and they went from just weird pirates to actual, like, a threat on, on the alien races. That would make more sense, because if they're mining the technology of the Reapers themselves. Right, so. Creature sightings. Blackout crimes. Blackout crimes. I want them. No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. We have one search parameter, Evie. <laughs> okay, we have one search parameter. Some of them might be a bit irrelevant. Rachnite. Rachnite activity. They are being trained. No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. So everything I thought is irrelevant. Okay, lovely. Okay, so... Prothean activity. I'm calling no on that one. Because if this killed a Reaper, it's older than the Protheans. Uh, locations with element, element zero. zero deposits. Let's assume that's needed. Okay. Based on the search results, Garno is in one of these five systems. I have marked the Normandy map with possible locations. We can leave now, unless you wish to further narrow the search. Uh... I mean, 
yeah, if we can still play around with it, then uh, Prothean activity, locations with element zero, Rachna activity, blackout crimes, creature sightings? Alien sightings. Three possibilities. Three? I mean, I don't want to put Prothean activity on there, Prothean but... Prothean artifacts. No results. Ah, good. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Right. Get rid of Protheans. Three possibilities. One, two, three, four. It kind of looks like there's meant to be another one here. Have I missed one? Is it the head? It's not the head. may have missed something out which is imperative to working out what the fuck this is decryption complete oh analyzing data these <laughs> movements do Idiot. not match the standard invasion pattern the reapers are searching for something and i'll bet garneau used this intel can you make a search filter for it of course i bet this is right so the reapers are hunting this thing reaper activity We have a match, marking the galaxy map. Oh Good. yes. Let's go find Garneau. Right, so uh, yeah, we just head back to the Normandy and now go hunting in that sector. Oh, we can go straight to the bar, that's cool. <laughs> in fact, you can't get to the hospital, it's just, you wanna go shopping, do you wanna go a drink, or do you wanna go home? I'll go back to the Normandy. A little bit of CSI going on there. I'm quite a fan of that. That's you see, for me personally, the standard has been set for DLC. In terms of combat, the Omega DLC, I think, was stupendous. I think it was fantastic. Commander. Um, in terms of innovation, I guess. The Shadow Broker. Being able to just drive a car, drive a car through the air, and lots of little things like that. It was just very, very different, and it really stuck out as being worth paying for. I should have actually checked. I think it's this one. Scan for Dr. Gunlight, okay. I was about to go to Sanctuary then, so I hope that's the worst DLC ever. If that's it. No, the Shadow Broker DLC was really something good. That was, uh... Also gave you a lot to go back to. Lots of little... Mm. Oh, no! Reapers eluded. Valor and Isola. Uh, yeah, the little tiny lore bits are fantastic for me. I absolutely love reading and seeing a little bit more about the, uh... different characters. Is there a planet somewhere? Did I go to the right one? Did I go to the wrong place? Scan for Dr. Garneau. Signal confirmed. Oh. We have located Garneau. On an asteroid? Mahavid is a metallic asteroid in the very sparse Nahata belt. It has a high nickel and iron content in the form of camasite. The rights to mine Mahavid belong to TGES Mineral Works, who sell their products primarily to the colonists of Alvuna. A close flyby reveals light emanating from its facilities, population 152. I can take 152 people. Let's kill everyone and get Garno out. I say it's a lab. It's, it's probably just there working. Um, okay. 
So we found this, we found this place by looking at Reaper activity. So we're going to assume there's going to be Reapers. So, Javik, let's give you the chance to go ham on some Reapers. And James, let's just do this for Earth. You wanna, you wanna see our Prothe, the Prothean in action? Right. Uh, I'm pretty set. I think I can't see anything else being better than them. Uh, however, I've got a much better <laughs> stuff, James, because I haven't used him in a long time. You can have a revenant, James. Damage. Rounds per mag. Okay. Defense drone maxed out. Still haven't got a name for him. Uh, Carnage Arms Master. Uh, squad mate, health and shield, please, James. <laughs> Put your life on the line for me. Uh, fortification. Damage protection. Increased melee bonus. Nah, I don't need melee on him. Uh... Incendiary ammo to make sure he can just kill a load of shit and set fire to it. And Javik does what he wants because I'm not the boss of him. We're about five minutes out, Commander. Cool. What exactly is on this asteroid? Mining facility. TGS Mineral Works. Small operation. Could be a good place for Leviathan to hide. We've all read Edie's notes on Bryson's lab. Any questions? Any more intel on what this Leviathan could have been? Not really. We only know it killed a Reaper. But it is this Garneau human, Bryson's partner we must locate. Yes. Right. If we find Garneau, we find Leviathan. Understood. Well, assuming he's found it, um, it's got my attention. <laughs> like, definitely. If, if this is one thing, I'm assuming they've analysed the, the body of the Reaper that died and kind of got the gist that it was killed by one thing. Powerful enough to take down a Reaper, but hiding from the war. There's more to this. That's it. That's what's making just me think it's not the answers we need. a big thing. I'm reading Reaper enemy signatures in the asteroid field. Brayson said they were shadowing his field teams. If they're after Leviathan 2, Reapers are a good sign. <laughs> That's not something you hear every day. <laughs> yeah. Take us in. Looks good. DLC always looks a little touch ahead of the rest of the game. Don't go anywhere, Cortez. We'll grab this guy and be right out. Keep <laughs> me updated on the Reaper situation. Yes, Commander. I can... I will put money on the fact that we will not be out in just a second. Are they asteroids just smacking against the glass? Scouting party. And by the sound of it, they're pissed off. Oh, shit. Oh, I wasn't expecting this. Oh, get off. Get out. Mm. Right. Okay, Javik, you're going to be somewhere. Yep, I trust you guys. You guys can do this. Just get my drone out. Although you could argue that the brutes are maybe a little bit more scary, nothing hits home harder than a banshee. <laughs> oh, hello. Grenades out. See, it's just Let's a... get Garneau before the serious troops arrive. <laughs> it's likely the civilians will be frightened. Hello there, giant Elko. 
Yes, you're not a serious troop, apparently. No, they're just... They're not as much of a threat as the Banshees are. The Banshees just bamp towards you so quickly. Yep, let's break in. Well, it makes sense they've locked down if the Reapers are attacking. Pretty chill. Yeah, the Reapers. What's with this business just, as usual. Yeah, like I just killed a whole bunch of people. I don't get the feeling I've just walked into a local pub and everyone's turned around and stared at me. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. You just had Reaper troops attacking your front door. Are they still there? I've taken care of them for now. I see. That will be all. <laughs> that will be. That will be all. Hello? <laughs> yes. Welcome to TGS Mineral <laughs> Works. How can we help you? Javik understands the concept of yes, customer service buttons. Yes, for the tour. Please sign in. What the fuck's going on here? You don't seem worried about those Reapers. You know something I don't? TGS Mineral Works is a small to mid-level supplier of tungsten to the galaxy. That's not what I meant. Are you familiar with the applications of tungsten? That's what they use on spaceships, isn't it? Um, I'm not gonna, Look, I need your help. No, snap the fuck out of it. Slap him in the face. Look, we don't have time to waste. I'm looking for a researcher, Dr. Garneau. He would have arrived within the last couple weeks. If he's still here, I need to speak to him. We have no Dr. Garneau. Do you need to see a doctor? <laughs> How about I just go in and look around? No. The access elevator is broken. I'm an engineer, I'll fix it. And now, we're done. Step away. Step away. You don't belong here. Something ain't right here, loco. Let's look around. Careful. It's like they all got... He was living in the ducts. Where is he now? Safe, locked up. It's like they all got mind controlled, like the. Is it Hadley? Even for primitives, their behavior is odd. Need to fix that elevator. Um. It's like they've all been taken over, but. Repair terminal activated. Oh. Um, but yeah, they've sort of been left on autopilot. But we have to stay with it. What? My drone's better than that. Don't have to stay with it for one thing. Repairs initiated. That wasn't hard. Why are these guys not fixing it? Access granted. Security log. Past seven days. Jan Randall, Alex Garneau, Stephen Bragg, and Fiona Triffin. Okay, so Garneau used the elevator. Anything else? Did he die? Yes, it was an accident, but he died. I don't know what to think about that. I'm looking for a Dr. Garneau. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> okay, go, oh, no worries. Julie noted. I'll fix the elevator. The security log at the elevator mentioned a Dr. Garneau. Why are they lying about that? No idea. Let's hope we don't have to look too far. Right. Two ways to go. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this. Are you guys just as freaky, or...? Uh, 
Oh shit, they're moving. Hello. Turn back. You shouldn't be here. Oh, lovely. I'm just going to have a look at your data pad. Note to staff. This new crossbreed appears harmless and would be inconspicuous in an office environment. However, it is exceedingly dangerous. Use extreme caution when working with all third generation plants. Okay, danger... Plants. They've all been poisoned by the plants, like the Thorian. Have you seen Dr. Garneau? You shouldn't be here. Evolutionary implications of human biotics. Shouldn't these people be mining or something? I love the fact that Javik just picked that up and started reading it. That's cool. I like it when they're sort of... This is a restricted area. Personnel ID number is required. I don't have that. Access denied. Fair enough. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I like it when the teammates sort of act like they're equals rather than just following me around. The terrain pain threshold before psychosis is too high. Once the pain stimuli is applied more quickly. Interesting. We should look into that. <laughs> Even estimating 60 days for complete global starvation is the merciful room. Absolutely. That's the data to use. Why is everyone so dark here? Turn back. You shouldn't be here. I'm trying to help. Welcome to the Mineral Lab. Our researchers are always hard at work. Okay. Oh, okay. Now we're back at the beginning. What the fuck is going on in this place? Okay. We're just breaking into this one. Turn back. Oh. Really? I'm getting that feeling. But they're not hostile. They're not attacking me. Unless they're all going to attack me in a minute. <laughs> Due to an increase in electrical storm activity, communications with the beta site research team have been delayed. We ask all those awaiting data to please be patient. Current forecasts indicate that the storm will dissipate by the end of the week. Regular communications will resume at this time. Okay. Electrical storm cut off communications. TGS Mineralworks has an eye on the future. Cutting edge research drives us forward. Okay. Shouldn't be here. Yeah, I know. TGS Mineral Works is focused on. Oh, it's it's on me. Oh, the camera was on me. They're stalking me. Whoever is working here. Okay, so I'm going to need an active patient number to go and get the level 5 clearance to then go and get the path. Okay. Okay. Scavenger hunt time. We need a active patient. Do I belong here? Turn back, Commander. Okay, he didn't say I don't belong here. TGS personnel review. Jeremy Brown, personnel ID number 23195, sector E maintenance. Since applying recent feedback, your work has shown a vast improvement. Your work with the corrupted skin samples we acquired was impressive. You are being given a promotion and a raise in security access level. Thank you for your hard work. This review is confidential. Employees are encouraged not to leave reviews in view of others. Personnel ID. <laughs> okay, let's go. So. This is a restricted area. An active patient file number is required. I don't okay. have that. Okay. Access denied. I gotcha. I gotcha. Going to take us back to the other place. Level 5 clearance. Hello, people. Cheer up. Where the hell was that other door?
Uh, it was this, wasn't it? This is a restricted security terminal. A level 5 passcode is required for access. I don't have one. Access denied. Hang on, don't I have the 231... Is it the thing that lets me in here? This is a restricted area. Personnel ID number is required. ID 231-95. Access granted. Whoop whoop. Crew quarters. December 23rd, 2178. Andrea. Hmm. I miss you. Why won't you return my emails? Your mother is very ill and needs to see you. I love you. Come home soon, Dad. Oh, shit. So, these people got sort of taken, if you will. Their minds taken quite a while ago. The quality of the ore samples from Sector 4 are tapering off. As of 01152175, that area will begin decommissioning procedures. Head of Mining Operation, Del Klosmeyer. Okay. Is that it in here? What did I get from coming in here? <laughs> Seventy-eight. I feel like I was supposed to get something in here. Quality of the ore samples from Sector 4 are tapering off. Area will begin decommissioning procedures. Unless it's telling me to head to Sector 4? Okay. Well, I don't think there's anything else in here. Let's head to Sector 4. Turn back. Yeah, yeah, You yeah. shouldn't be here. This is a restricted security terminal. A level 5 passcode is required for access. I don't have one. Access denied. See, it kind of says that I should be able to go through the crew quarters and then up to the science offices. I don't have an active patient file number. Is there a journal with the... Uh... Nope, it's just a whole general find Dr. Garneau. This is probably so easy, <laughs> and I've just completely missed it. So I unlocked this area, crew quarters. Is that there? Can't go back there. Is that there? And that's it. And then on the inside... <clears throat> I am so lost. <laughs> this is the quality streaming entertainment that you've tuned in for. As an idiot just gets lost in a simple scavenger hunt. I mean, maybe I pick something up and I'm not quite clicking it together. So... Back here... Done all that... Because there's the locked door here... I don't have that. Access denied. 
Right. You shouldn't be here. Maintenance carriage. This is a restricted area. An active patient file number is required. Oh, hang on. I don't have that. Access denied. This is a restricted oh. area. An active patient file number is required. I don't have that. Access denied. Okay, well, there's two things there to click on, and neither of them work for me. So that's where I got the ID from. Turn back, Commander. Which took me all the way back to the start. Can I not just shoot some shit? Oh. Hello? Attention. Calm system is offline. This message was not sent. Grayson. Gano, we're coming to help you. So, he's still here. Do we have that passcode hack? Yes. Just input it at the security terminal. So, what was that first one about? Is it a red herring? Right. Punch in Garno's terminal hack and see what it gets us. <laughs> Probably they're all going to be alerted to us. And we're going to have to kill them all. A ship dropped him off a week ago. Looks like he had full access before he went into hiding. And they're more animated back then. <clears throat> Unknown male was involved in an altercation in the mines. This guy no human was headed to the mines. Looks like he was taken to the med bay. Do we you get are a in the file? Lab, a low security, all access area. The med bay is restricted to authorized personnel with active patient file numbers. I've got the file number. <laughs> Let's go get Garneau. So that first one was completely irrelevant? Right. I'm only partly an idiot. That's fine, I can live with that. This is a restricted area. An active patient file number is required. Got it. File 7364. Access granted. Out a boy, James. Right. Guns out. I assume there's no danger because I can't. Is that Garneau? Hope the hell it isn't. If you are looking for Garneau, you have found him. I am Dr. Garneau. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. Are you alright? No! Yes. Only I'm trapped in here. Uh, what happened to you here? Did you always sound so monotone? What's been going on in this place? I was doing my research. Until the incident. They attacked you. It's true. But aside from my confinement, I'm fine. Okay. So they, they imprisoned you in here. Uh, yeah, come with me, man. Bryson's research led me to you. Bryson sent you? Yeah. He's dead, Doctor. Killed by his assistant. I was going to I say see. that later, but okay. I need you to tell me everything you found on the Leviathan. Bryson seemed to think it killed a Reaper. It's a myth. A dead end. What about the artifact you talked about in your message? 
I did? No. Yes, Doctor. You did. Ooh, but now okay. we've got Reaper forces attacking, so I need to break you up. We'll grab the artifact and go. Reapers. The darkness must not be breached. The darkness? Why do you pursue me? Doctor? Leave the artifact. You will not take what is mine. He is not himself. This is not Gono we are talking to. No shit, Javik. You. You killed a Reaper. I need your help. You bring only death. How much power through a, a prowl, if you will? Uh, open the door. Are we chasing? Is this Dr. Eva again? Someone cut the power. There he goes. Leave this place. No. Wait. We need to get to that artifact before he does. He said it was in the mines. We'll need to find a different route. Right. Oh my god. Oh, okay. <clears throat> right. Gardo's notes gave us a nav point for the artifact. The map indicates a service door at the next tram station. Okay. Looks like we're not the only ones headed that way. We not? Hey, I'd be worried if there weren't Reapers. Oh. Shoot. Okay. Are we, are we fighting or are we going? I just chucked Terry down a hole. down there. Why is this place a maze? <laughs> Am I that fucking stupid? Can't jump up there. Can't run up a wall. Ooh, loot. The loot is the way to go. Right. <clears throat> We're going short range, lads. Feels good. Yeah. There he goes. What? Oh, hello. Not just a chase. Okay, I was getting cocky. Let's go back. Go back. Okay, I need twin revenants, guys. Go on, drone. Zap him. We don't have a sniper. Should have brought Garrus. James, aren't you a soldier? Why can't you use a sniper? Alright, Ashley. No. A throw like me. Hi. 
Right. Oh! Whoa! No, no, no! Should I say easy as pie? Give up all the ground. Goodbye! No! Oh. Yeah, Javik, you've got this, right? It's a primitive. It's nothing. It's a two! Oh my lord! You can go do it. James, you are completely correct to hide. I've got no ammo. I don't know if my defense runs up for me now. Right. I'm screaming. Actually, it gives me goosebumps every time I hear that one pitch. <laughs> I will talk in a minute. <sighs> There's the door. Okay, let's find that artifact. I hate those bloody things. Right. I can't even remember what I was going to say. I was going to say something then, and I can't even remember. <laughs> I do believe that's a rack. <laughs> okay, yep, that'll do. Oh, it's dead. Cool, we're good. Place the Metagel immediately, I like that. Cranial Trauma System 4. What just happened? Looks like the door's power supply has been cut. I'm seeing the trouble spots. The drone could handle it. We'll need to escort it. But the drone is damaged. Its power reserves are limited. Let's make really? it quick then. Just remember what I was going to say is the noises. Uh, the two enemies, like the, the two... Oh. The two enemies that stick in my head the most, I guess. The Reapers and the Banshees. Both have incredibly iconic noises. Oh, are we just fighting out from this position? Shit. Uh... Oh, no! That's not good. Are they jumping to their death? Oh, no, 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 they're not. Shit. One repair done. One to go. Gotta hold on a little longer. Understood! Hey. Stay close to the drone! Got it. I'd love to. Shepard, we still need to escort that drone! Shut up! You need to be closer to the drone. We should hurry! On it! Good. Nailed it. No, 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 no. Punch him. No, you know what? Fuck this. I'm not a melee class. 
Ow! Oh. Rocket to the face. I hear you. I'm on it. Can't see a flamethrower anywhere, so I'm trying to trying to make sure my oh there you go, my heart is now there. That's fine. Oh shit! I didn't see you there, you prick! Gotta get that drone over there, Shepard! We cool, we cool. Ah oh, shit! Oh, we got a banshee! Ha, 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 ha. A Reaper Black Star. Where's the banshee? I got it. It's like a little mini Reaper ship. Aww. Let's head back. You did good, drone. Online. <laughs> yeah, if I can have one of them any time a banshee appears, that'd be great. Fucking artifact. Damn it. Was that Garno working against the voice, or was that what the voice wanted? Holy shit. Commander, check this out. What have you got? That wasn't Garno. This is. Looks like he's been dead for a while. Oh. So, Leviathan can have Bryson killed, can take over this colony, and he can use them as puppets. Huh. Anything else useful? Encrypted data and a personal log with eight missed calls from a Dr. Ann Bryson. Ann Bryson? Who... Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Commander Shepard. Are you all right? Let me guess, I don't I belong think here? So. I feel like... I feel strange, but... All right. <laughs> okay. Uh... What, what's been going on? Can you tell me anything about what happened to you? Not really. I, uh... Remember... It just seemed cold. I remember a, a feeling... Cold and dark. If dark was a feeling, that's exactly what I felt. Okay. I mean, is it like a a reaper that's gone against the rest of them? Because it's kind of got the powers of them, and it's hiding out in dark space where they hide. Uh, do you know Gano? You know what he was here for? Do you recognize this man? I've never seen him before in my life. Someone here killed him. Someone here? How is that possible? I'm so sorry. It's okay. Uh, what's the artifact? That artifact. Do you know where it came from? It came out of the mine. Right. Head office was supposed to send someone. That's about all I can... Okay, so Garno was the person that was sent for? Cortez, what's your situation? Can you bring the shuttle? Affirmative. Strangest thing. A couple of minutes, 
ago, the Reaper forces broke off and left. Reaper? What's a Reaper? What year do you think this is? 2176. 2176 was ten years ago. What? Let's arrange for these people to be evacuated into temporary quarantine. And a psychologist? These people are unaware of the past ten years. Many things will shock them. Yeah. Like you, Javik. Like, <laughs> these people would have just turned around and gone, Oh, what are you? Has the power to take down a Reaper and possesses the ability to indoctrinate. It's a Reaper. Maybe this thing is a Reaper. Yes. We need that fucking power. I want to be riding a Reaper into battle. If it's a Reaper, we need to know its motivations. How long has it been out here? And more importantly, why? Edie. Did we get anything from Gardo's notes? Yes. They suggest that Gardo created a way to block the artifact's mind-affecting properties. The artifact seems to be the key. Agreed. When I head back to Bryson's office, I want you there. Yes, Commander. I want to know just what the hell these artifacts really are and what they can do. Powerful and dangerous. That's what they are. And we've got one sitting right in the middle of the Citadel. Yeah. So the Reapers broke off the second that it was destroyed? Hmm. That's not good. Still kicking. From Grace Sato. Commander Shepard, just wanted to say how indebted I am to you, not just for saving my life, but for giving me a greater sense of purpose. After our ordeal securing the array based on Onterom, I now know I have something more than my technical expertise to offer. Grace Sato, Systems Technician, 3rd grade. Good, I'm glad. Anyone moved? Anyone need anything? I don't think so. Right. Are we going back? I guess we've got to manually go back to uh, Dr. Bryson's. I don't know how long this is going to take. Um... I really don't. I don't know what to do here. I don't know whether to try and do it in one video or not. Um, so, we'll just see. I mean, I'll, it'll probably be closer to about two hours. Um, oh, yep, I forgot about that. I'm not going to investigate Sanctuary. Piss off. Let's go to Dr. Bryson's lab again. Let's see how many stages this thing has. It is interesting, though, that this DLC kind of, I mean, I could have done that bit much earlier. Um, didn't I get it before I did the Samara mission? In which case, if I'd have done this first, I'd have fought Banshees without them being properly introduced. That seems a bit weird. Um, Dr. Bryson's lab again. Telling me to spend my points. Okay, we need to destroy that thing, I think. We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Yeah, it's just kind of been there. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Oh, nice. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. But is it an ally? I mean, it's... It's kind of going after the people we're working with. It's kind of like a chaotic good, it kind of seems like... Okay, yeah. I'd call it dangerous as hell. Bryson's assistant tried to kill me. Yeah. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself, diverting people away from its trail. Maybe. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with yet. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Yeah. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. 
Well, Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. I don't know. I <laughs> guess we'll analyze the artifact itself. Bryson's assistant, Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? Dead. He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. Whoops. But the miners recovered when the artifact was destroyed. Hadley lost consciousness when he attempted to answer our questions about Leviathan. It may have been a deliberate attempt to silence him permanently. Oh. So those things were indoctrinated. So on the on the asteroid, they were indoctrinated, but left to wonder. But because at the time, the Reaper, or I should say the Leviathan, was in Hadley's mind, he decided to just rip his brain out, basically. Lovely. I'm happy. Energy emission tests. Artifact P3X or 118. Derek Hadley. Initial tests. Artifact tests negative for infrared and ultraviolet emissions. No gamma or x-ray radiation detected. Follow-up tests. Artifact does not react to application of various stimuli. Internal readings inconclusive. No progress in determining age. Guess I stayed here all night finding out that this thing isn't really important. Fell asleep at desk. <laughs> I know that uh, to be reported. Conclusion. Artifact is definitely inert and safe. Recommend keeping it here for reference. We should all be near it. May be more useful than Leviathan in long run. Recommend we abandon Hunt for Leviathan and seek more productive studies. So I guess that those three bits of the three stages of indoctrination alongside it. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. So at the beginning he was testing it, and then it was like, oh, I'm just so tired, I don't know. And then the third one was just like, we should all hug it. I feel like it would give us superpowers. Anything interesting about the artifact structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance. Okay. It doesn't seem to be that interesting, then. Nessie, what do you think? Edie, what project was Garno working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? They're turning you to Several stone. ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. <laughs> it possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. <laughs> I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then, no. <laughs> There's got to be something here on this artifact. What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. That is awesome, because I feel that's a bit of a clap back at various different games, like... Doesn't matter how good your armor is, if you are if you get hit by this attack, it's an auto-kill. Final Fantasy XIV has quite a few of them. Uh, is it just upstairs you want us to go? Can I interest you in the toilet first? No, nope. he was not working by the toilet. Check messages. A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scara paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried mm. to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garno on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. We need her. She's the only one who does. Wherever she is, we have to find her. Absolutely. She sounded concerned for her safety. If Reaper forces are closing on her position... Then we'll kill him. Then we find her first. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. 
I'll call up the nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down your location. <laughs> so I guess you you can because when when I had like five planets, it said you can leave if you want or you can narrow it down. So I'm guessing you can just leave straight away. And it goes like you know, just just hit and miss. You have to scan every single one and you'll eventually get it. So if, if you knew what planet it was, you could actually just go straight there. The Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do. Yes. But I thought we were looking for clues, man. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. Yes, we probably will. Where is that? Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. Task Force Aurora, current travel requisitions. Project Basilisk, team leader Alex Garneau, transport MSV Kirkwall. Kirkwall, okay. So we'll be able to look up Kirkwall and we'll... Should hopefully be able to track the ship? Oh wait, no, hang on. Project Basilisk, it's Project Scarab we want. Team leader Anne Bryson on the Icarus. Anne Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Icarus, okay. Can you yeah. track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian oh. comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. Where the fuck am I going to find the ship's specifications? There are specifications for oh. several <laughs> ships here. We need to find the Icarus. <laughs> All right, fine. Uh, the Ni Nikunas. Which ship am I looking for again? The Icarus. We are looking for the Icarus. Which ship am I looking for oh, okay. again? Yeah. Okay. The yeah. Icarus. I was hoping that would change it. Okay. Nikunas. Well, that's the Icarus, but I kind of want to go through them. All. The Gal. The Galdu. Oh, there's only three. All right, Icarus. The Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. And allow you to fly so near the sun? So jumped the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system. Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay. We can rule out the relay system. Okay. Well, that's... That's good. Ship schematics allows for that. Uh... Anything else? Lo oh, the, the lock locker is secure. We must locate an access card to open it. Where the fuck am I going to have a desk? This is a desk. Head. You've got to be for something. Like, like, is it like a, a, a key holder? Like, is he holding stuff in there? Like, it's his wallet? Access card for the requisitions locker? Yes. Done and done. According to records, it was last used by Anne Bryson to obtain equipment for Project Scarab. Let's see what Anne Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Okay, equipment. Didn't need an environmental suit. Okay, so that tells us that the the planet is livable. Like, uh, humans can live there. Assault rifle Omniblade. Well, it shows that she didn't need to stab a bitch. Didn't take breathing masks. Well, that's part of the environmental suit, isn't it? Water recycling equipment. So Based on what Anne Bryson planet? did or did not requisition. Oh, the arid, deep site yeah. was arid but habitable. Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. Hell yeah. I mean, that's pretty decent. Ship schematics. Based on the search data, it is one of these two systems. And then an arid planet. Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Anne Bryson. CSI Shepard. See you later, Eddie. All right. Uh, back to the Normandy. 
And let's go do this. Hour and 25. Fuck it. I want to play. I want to combat things. I've already failed at looking for stuff. I want to be able to shoot things. None of those uh, banshees, though. Everyone knows banshees require a lot of water. <laughs> We're going to an arid planet. So, hopefully, there'll just be a whole land full of husks. There's no reapers here. No reapers is an interesting thing. Oh, okay, apparently there are reapers here. I found something. Oh, no, 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 not now. Start scanner. Are they moving? Oh, they better not be fucking moving now. What is it? The Jovian Dissertation. Right, I picked up someone's homework. Goodbye. Faster than light jump successful. Dirada and Zahiri. Signal confirmed. There we go. Nice arid planet there. Oh, hello. Okay. So, is it another asteroid? Nope, that's just fuel to get home with. That's very useful. So, Namakli. An arid but habitable planet. Namakli was briefly colonized by the Pyrena Corporation, a consortium of Asari colonists and socialized Vorture laborers. After an economic downturn, however, many Asari left the planet and the Vorture population kept growing to the point where they bred faster than they could be educated. <laughs> oh, it's like Essex in England. Um, I'm sure that relates to different places. Mississippi in America, I think. Um, and the colony is essentially self-destructed. <laughs> Today, Namakli is a wasteland with little population, but vulture packs are scattered across the deserts. Settlers frequently run into these packs, discouraging recolonization. The lack of complex biota and scarcity of profitable metals drove the last few proverbial nails into Namakli's coffin. No one has stepped forth in the past few years with the will, the funding, or the firepower to establish a permanent colony. So it's just a bunch of roving Vorture. Oh, I don't want to kill Vorture. I want to kill Reapers, not Vorture. Okay. Search successful. Scans have located a close grouping of environmentally shielded habitats and an active power source. Close examination is required to confirm dig site. We have presence. located Anne Bryson's dig site. Goody goody. Alright, uh, population. There is no population to count. They have bred too fast. Okay. Right. It has been a while. But. Uh, okay, no, 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 no. Rather than thinking of who we haven't bought for a while, let's think. We're killing Vorture, and I think Reapers were moving him. So. I'm thinking. If there's going to be anyone on the team that is happy to kill civilized aliens, it's going to be Ashley. And then. Ashley's the soldier. I'm mid range. Garrus is long range. We kind of work as a unit. Revenant on Ashley, Matic on me, and then whatever the gun was I bought with Garrus. Um, yep, yeah, I think we're happy with that. Revenant and Viper. And Revenant and Viper. Oh, they're both snipers. I forgot about that. That's going to be quite good. Close range, we'll have two Revenants, and long range, we'll have two uh, Vipers. Ooh. Six points. 
I mean, I'm leveling Cryo up. I never use it. Never use it. But I've almost maxed my Shepherd. Which is so cool. Um, <clears throat> four points for you. May as well put it in Disruptor Ammo. Health and bonus. Increase shield. Squad mates gain Disruptor Ammo. Now stay alive. <laughs> Just please stay alive. You're my tank. And as for you, well, let's have a proximity mine. Slowing down, you can be a good support. Yep, you can have that as well, because I don't know how many more level ups we're going to get. Okay, so we got reports of an attack on some scientists, right? Yep, they're human, don't worry. You, you can be allowed to want to save them. Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Okay, we're playing catch-up, I guess. They're already there. Yes. The attack means the Reapers are one step ahead of us. We need to pick up the pace. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. That artifact she uncovered could be causing trouble. We've already seen what they can do. Agreed. Take us in closer. I love Copy how that. everyone has something to say. No matter who I'm bringing, they interject in their way. It doesn't feel like everyone's got the same dialogue. We have hostiles! Take us in. Commander, on the landing platform! Hang on, hasn't this thing got a turret? That's her. Open the door, let me shoot. Okay, let's get... Damn it! Shacking yes. multiple bogeys! Oh. Get us over there! Okay. Negative, it's too hot! Heading to lower platform, hang on! There, go! Jump! Jump? Okay, Cortez, you'll be fine, I think. Find some cover! But, oh my god. Initial thing could come down. Move! She's somewhere above us. Holy crap! They're all harvesters! I've never seen an army like that on here. That is insane. Is anyone there? No, stay where you are. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance Navy. It's too dangerous. We'll come to you. Yes, okay. You should take the elevator up on the far side. Copy that. Trying. On our way. Try ah. Lived off the edge and died, that's fine. I'm more than happy to support that behaviour. Through here. Love how he's so confident, just through here. This upside down building. I know the schematics. They're swarming everywhere up here. Can you find a place to hide? I'll try. Get there. Stay put. That's in stone. Hey, I'm having a history lesson now. Do that? Or the Asari? How old is it? I am trying to learn. Right. I'm pretty sure all my drone does is electrocute people, so I'm calling it now. His name is going to be Eli. A raider. Hello there. Uh, oh, you guys don't have shotguns? Carried by the Batarian military's notorious special intervention unit. 
<laughs> oh, I love that. Only the Batarians can have... Hello there, we're the special intervention unit. And <laughs> we're going to blow your fucking face off. The Raider is a semi-automatic shotgun that loads slowly but fires rapidly with tremendous force. Short range even for a shotgun, the Raider has a large pellet spread. Rather than eliminating recoil, its integral compensators instead make it predictable and vertical. I'm in. Uh, what's lighter out of these two? It is... What happens if I get rid of that? One, two, five. Oh, you know what? Fuck it. I'm, I'm, in the, I'm in the mindset of if they give you a weapon in a level, it's designed for that level. This is going to be close-up quarters. <laughs> oh, yes, this hits powerfully. Oh, I might have to just level this up. That was yellow. What the fuck is Watch that? Out. Now what? Look for another path. Hello? Ladder up. Where the fuck are you going? Can we hop across there? We can. Looks like a bridge over there. I still want to talk about those, uh, that cave painting. Bit. Yes, there's another one. Are these new or. Oh, oh whoa, 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 whoa. Let's just pause the world around us. They've all got spears. They're humanoid, but have the body shape that could realistically be Solarians, Asari, humans. They've all got Wyashuma spears. And there's a dead guy there. And that person's got a really long spear. So either they're fighting it, or it's like a ritual? Okay, we, we need to have a chat. Controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Right away. Some yep. wires are okay. short. Shouldn't take much to fix it. Give me a sec. Yeah, no worries. Okay, there's only two bullets. Raising I... the bridge now. Okay. I'm on it. Okay. Yeah. On the double! This is the wrong gun. This is the wrong gun. I've made so many mistakes. What the fuck just hit me? Did they have range? Because I've got no cover. Bridge is up. Don't care. We're killing it. I'm not even following me. Can't be far. Right. I only have two bullets. When it's a semi-automatic, I thought we were gonna be like banning the hammer of a shotgun. I have two bullets in fire. It's a double barrel shotgun. But come on, weapon bench. This way. Okay. Weapon bench, please be a weapon bench. SMG mass pulse recoil system. Sure. Anything with mass in it is going to be good in this game. So. More 
So I'm stuck for the rest of my life. Oh, there's another painting over there. I got rid of my second gun as well. I... That'll do. Right. No one underneath this one. That's not someone. Okay. So there were people here that either fought the Reapers or celebrated them. Okay. Oh, weapon bench, oh, weapon bench. My kingdom for a weapon bench. Blocked. Find another way. I mean, this whole thing is just floating above a rock base, right? Like, at any point, this whole thing could come down. This way looks good. Does it? I don't think any of this Commander, looks good. Attack my assistant, Hopkins. We're being cornered. Stay hidden, Doctor. We're trying, but there's too many of them. Hurry. Hurry? Do you have any idea what I'm doing here, woman? Hold up. I've got to remember it recoils directly up, so I've got to hold down when I'm firing. <laughs> oh no! Okay. It's annoying because I've got to get close to hit it with this shotgun. Seems like it when you get the double pop off though, and it does hit hard. Is that it? Because I've seen some paintings I want to analyse. Go on, Terry. Terry, Linky, Eli. Okay, that'll... Is that a bit chubbier? I feel that's a bit chubbier. It's a chubby reaper. Uh, some big long boys. What the fuck are they, Slender Man? Okay, Slender Man and the Reapers Man, working are you together. Still there? We're barely hanging on. Hopkins is wounded. Are you close? We're moving as fast as we can. Hang in there. See, that's not fighting. That's that's holding hands, children. Platform's coming down. Shut up. History Round. is more important. Go around. And that person's worshiping. Oh, is this what? Are we gonna find out that the Reapers were good all along? No, no, Boyles, stay down. Oh God. What's happening? Don't move until we get there. Oh shit, it was there. Damn, I thought my, I thought my turret was missed. Right. That should thin out the herd a lot. Mm 
you're really coming down here. You are stupid. Ah, what the fudging hell. All right. I would say we'll take that one down, but I really don't want to incur the wrath of the 96 other ones. Drone, I upgraded your range. No, that's not defense drone. I upgraded your range for this reason. Go on, Eli. Ooh. Feels good when a shotgun works. It's late in the day to change up my setup, but if I could make the shotgun much lighter, I would bring that in the matter. Baby person. It's more long boys. I mean, Banksy really doesn't look good in the future. I'm just saying. Right. I see the elevator. Okay. Get to it. Yep. Let's go. No messing around. Other than the fact I'm just gonna peek around here, see if there is anything extra. Damaged machinery. Ooh, money. Goody goody gun drops. Oh, that is where we went around. Okay, no worries. <laughs> to the elevator. Everybody in the flimsy little elevator. Elevator's online. We're coming up. Please hurry. I think Hopkins is dead. <laughs> well... <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna take a wild guess and say yes. He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? The Reapers were too much. No, the Reapers are what the Reapers are. You are all that's left. I need you to snap out of it. Don't care about anyone else. Keep up with me as we run. They're not coming. We have to keep moving. Yes, uh, yeah, of course. It's harsh, but it's a, uh, we need a sharp slap to the face just to make you go breathe later. I uh, was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but... Why? What's happening? Shepard, look. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? It's a reaper. Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old. Much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper. Oh. But acting alone. Not like any reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact. Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! Oh shit! Okay, so we've what got a Super doing? Saiyan Marauder. They've activated this. I've never managed anything. Doctor? No! They've you... learned to uh, The darkness must not be breached. They're Shepherd. learning its coordinates. Take it out! 
Got it. You okay? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle, you run. Don't look back. Okay. Don't get shot. Yes. Wait, are we not doing the same? Oh, <laughs> all right. Right. Okay, step number one. Oh. You need to get rid of that harvester. Fuck her off. We'll bring it down. No, we won't. Okay, I don't want them exploding next to me, so that'll do. What are our other pieces? I don't like that Reaper looming over us as we're fighting. Fucking, he's going for us as well. Uh, right, okay. We'll eliminate all the little boys. Oh, interesting. Okay. Can't overload these. It seems like I'm wasting ammo, and you are right, I am. But I'm clearing away for you to run up there. No! I thought... I thought I timed that barrage thing perfectly. Hello. No, <laughs> that just went horrifically wrong. I thought I knew what I was doing then. But no, that's fine. That's uh, completely respectful. Two of our roll! I need to get rid of a lot more than that, Cortez. Okay. Maybe I just call an offense against this. Just keep me on and see if anything else can now. Oh, hang on, is there an explosive pop there? Oh, they are laying into it with the revenue. Okay, Cortez, get in here. <laughs> okay, clean up crew. Oh, I couldn't have got across anyway. Fuck it out. Yeah, we're killing everyone here. Everybody, let's go! No, we're killing everyone. It's been really embarrassing when I die here. Bad. You look you all look alike. Sorry. You look just like a marauder. Oh, I'm a terrible person. Is that unlimited? We good? We're good. Unfortunately, the other side of Garrus's face looks just like uh, the one that took the rocket. But other than that, we cool. Come on, get out there. There's something good in it. Some money. The med kit. Nice. Okay, right, then that's it, lads. Two long boys, a massive reaper. Lots of people worshipping it. I guess it does make sense. They were fighting at the beginning, and now they're sort of under its control, but kind of 
find out there's like a whole planet that is just under reaper control and it's just like a game You're of okay. sims yeah commander i i think so i blacked out leviathan took control of you we cut the connection before you got hurt leviathan itself that's incredible the reapers seem as interested in it as we are yeah it certainly seems that way we were hoping you could help us figure out why First, Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue, or even a defector. Well, it is in dark space, because... I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne, you need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. I'm sorry. He's... What? Dead? He can't be dead. We couldn't stop it because he, it was just out of the blue. He even called for his assistant and the assistant just shot him. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. You're making it seem Something like you happened? shot him. You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next drew a gun on your father. They couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Ben? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation. Meet you there. Yeah. Go back to his office and see those, uh... See those little childhood drawings that ED, ED decided was um, a poor excuse for art? Reporting in. Lee Riley. Commander, my squad continues to defend the fuel reactors on Sion. The Reapers seem intent on taking it down. Not on my watch. We will hold the line. Kirahi. Going to be with us in the final battle. Uh, Captain Lee Riley. We've got a medal, I believe. Fast track the medal for her. Rightly so. Commander. Right. Um, we are going to finish it there, although I am just going to have a quick look. And nobody else has moved. So we will do a round robin of everyone, but after the uh, DLC has come to its uh, fruition, because I don't know how long's left. Oh my God, I mean, we've played this DLC for solidly for two hours. Admittedly, most of that was me wandering around like a moron, not able to do the next thing. But be interesting to see how long this goes on for. So, thank you very much for watching. Have a wonderful week, guys, and take care. See you later.